We're about to finish some buildings, though, so I gotta build up a little money for that again. Uh, certainly there's a pattern, Celestial Bodies. However, I'm putting this endeavor for the sake of my other duties. Uh, I'm not satisfied yet. Keep keep going. We might get a big breakthrough and get some serious clout in the Hermetic Society. So just for being base level, Temple Opinion is lower. Lame. At next level, though, we do get learning. Learning, learning. Yeah, every level, every different rank we get, we get more learning, which is pretty nice. 20% chance of becoming diligent. Please become diligent. It's so good. It makes everyone respect you more and you gain one stat point and everything. No sound effect. We didn't get diligent. Lame. Another siege done. Okay, all that's left is their capital. And then we'll finally... Okay, it's 100 people insta-siege that. Thank you. Oh no, that was them insta sieging the trade post. Okay, I'm just... Oh no, I'm not going to build a new one on there because I actually, if I win the war, I believe I get one there. Oh no, the war just ended inconclusively. Cool. I'm going to immediately build one there before they get to start on it then. And I don't want to boat them all the way home, so I'm just going to do that and my vassals will lose half their troops. Whatever. <laughs> They'll build it back up quick. If anything, it stops rebellions. Uh, swordsmith built. Beautiful. Uh, so the swordsmith was heavy infantry and pikemen. Very nice units. And then that applies with all of our levy size bonuses and stuff. All right, we have a trade post going up there. It's expensive to start because it's so far away and in foreign lands. And hopefully they won't hate me so much that they won't just burn it down right away. But, you know, uh, I'm happy to have a trade post starting there, especially because it'll give me a war goal on them once I have one there. And then I can start, you know, working my way in to get that land. You gotta get your foot in the door. Okay, let's build up a little bit of money and get something going here. Um, I could get a secluded shrine, actually. Temple of Vassal Opinion up by 10. That will offset being in the Hermetic Society. And piety is nice. Um, I don't... I barely have enough money, so I'm actually gonna wait a second here. Oh, see, here. This is why it's good to wait a second. Yes, I need to spend 200 to keep the trade route going, and I make way more than 200 off of it. So yes, refresh the trade route. And yes, I will gain a commander. And another place prospers. Beautiful. Uh, dangerous factions? Not too dangerous. Uh, but we will murder. Murder's fun and profitable. Who's the strongest in here? Is it one of these kings? Uh, this guy's got a lot of troops. Kill him. Oh, he's kind of hard to kill. Well, the council's not going to be discontent forever. It'll calm down soon. Just start the plot. Unless we could do like a really easy plot on someone else. Like on this guy. It's easier. Fuck it, we'll start on him. Why the war stop? Because the place, the, um, what's it called? The um, trade post we were warring over got destroyed, but we had no choice in that. It was what was getting attacked next and we had to control the county, so. It's a stupid war goal that doesn't often work out. But it destroyed the thing so that we could build one, which is convenient. Everything is so clear now. Monthly prestige, more esoteric knowledge. Nice. And didn't get money. Nice. Okay. Well, we got Stone Road here, which is awesome. More tax income, more trade value. The trade value really pays off fast. Like, what are we getting per month? We're getting 65 rounded up. 65 ducats a month we are getting nearly 800 a year that is so good for this point in the game it's not even year a thousand uh no keep observing uh yeah i want to learn as much as i can your half sister mega cake has been reading the teachings of the tengiri faith that's not fun don't like that you only need the county of jerusalem um and the gold piety to build the thing to reform the religion. Okay. Okay. Uh, it's getting stronger. Can we bribe anyone on the cheap here? Not anyone good. No, just some really low level people. It's my master of Bohemia. I wish I could get him in. Okay. Can you usurp another kingdom's counties? Not really interested in doing that right now, unless we have, like, a really good cheap opportunity. Uh, I don't want to spend any money on that right now. That's such a low-priority place. We gotta save up the money for other places. Like our secluded shrine and stuff. 
I always want something to be going in our capital. Uh, making sure that landowners and traders are paying taxes in a timely fashion is a consuming task. Uh, lose stewardship or lose some gold. Some dues cannot be neglected. Lose a tiny bit of money and not lose stewardship. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not willing to get more research done, but lose that on stewardship. No. We have a truce with the guy that owns Jerusalem now. Eh, I can kill him. Uh, keep studying. I want to get something out of this. Port finished. Awesome. And we can education on a kinsman here. He can be educated and marshal because we don't have enough commanders. Invest in troops. The crusades are coming. Yeah, we're already investing in troops. That's what we've been doing up here. We've been building militia stuff now to start increasing the troop numbers. Oh, great. The Holy Roman Empire just declared war on us. Wow, they haven't done that in a really long time. I'm kind of surprised they did that. Um, convert to attacker's religion? No. I'm, why is that set to... Yeah, fuck off. I'm not putting that as a major thing. Um, yeah, we can't possibly beat them. Like, there's a 0% chance they outnumber us like a billion to one, so we should just peace out immediately. I mean, we could make them lose some money just by waiting, but it would also be bad for us. Uh, yeah, what is their war goal right now? What are they trying to take? It's a second holy worm for uh, Bavaria. Isn't Bavaria in here? Um, if we do by... Because they can just have that. I don't... Yeah, they're just going for that. I don't want this. I don't care about that castle. Have it. I surrender. <laughs> I'm not going in a drag out war for that. What do I surrender if I if I surrender this? I lose 100 piety, that's nothing. I lose 3% moral authority for my religion, that's nothing. I lose 50 prestige, that's nothing. And he vassalizes that. Who cares? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Who gives a shit about that? <laughs> oh, weird. There we go, He, it's his. Who cares? Okay, well, now we've got a truce. Cool. He likes us more? Why? I guess just because we're not at, at war anymore. Huh. That was dumb. He could have asked for it. If he had threatened a war, I probably would have said, oh, yeah, have it, whatever. If we get a truce. Uh, yeah, drop 30 bucks on continuing research. That's cheap. Have you ever played Sunless Sea? No. Uh, Peasant Revolt is declared on him. Okay. It's just a peasant revolt. He'll be fine. The peasant revolt has 3,000 troops. Yeah. I get the feeling that's not going to uh, do anything. <laughs> yeah, we do need to get Prague back one day, but that day is not soon. It's why we're trying to build troops. One of the many reasons why we're trying to build troops. Uh, see a chatterbox. Esoteric knowledge, monthly prestige. Nice. Merchant trade port. Nice. Get that money coming in. I understand so much. Satisfied with your progress, you conclude your research. Okay. And we cannot spend that money right now. I gotta save up some money for mercenaries and stuff in case this dangerous faction really gets out of hand. Anyone changing their opinions around here? I can get you. You're kind of cheap, but we need more than that. Got another commander. Good. What is this? Uh, several commanders lack formal training. I am not giving you a favor, no. You can just be irritated. I do not want people calling in favors of me. Uh, yeah, it's going to be informing me of wars of countries I don't care about because I'm swaying them. Celebrate Passover? Yes, I do want to celebrate Passover. We're a new ruler and we got to make sure that the rest of the Jewish lords like us. This is an easy, low-cost way of getting them to start to like you. Okay. Someone owes me a favor? Some bishop. <laughs> Some orthodox bishop. Weird. Um, what is this? Um, oh, a star should be bear my own name, which would give me diplomacy, esoteric knowledge, and proud, which is nice. It is, it is prestige. Aren't I humble right now? I am not humble. I was going to say, I'd like to be humble for the piety. Uh, this would give me diplomacy, though, and makes my wife like me more. Which, I'd prefer that, actually. Yeah. The diplomacy is more important. 
and having her on better relations. In fact, also give her a gift there. She's at 100. Gotta make sure she's faithful. Gotta have a lot of kids. All right. Refuse pass over invitation. Yeah, that's gonna happen. There's always a handful of people who refuse. All right. How goes the progress of uh, my trade post down here? It's a little over half done. Okay. They have an outbreak of smallpox in there. Okay. Bummer. No, we can just be zoomed out for a little bit. No reason to be that zoomed in right now. Hospital progress. Right. We don't have anything going there right now. Thanks for the uh, resub there. Uh, please end the pain. Oh, wife's pregnant again. Nice. Pass the matzo. And get the secluded shrine started. Message arrives. Uh, opening a foreign trade post. Yep. Demand com uh, compensation. Next year in Jerusalem. Hopefully in Jerusalem that we own next year. But there, a bunch of my vassals like more. And he didn't pay me. Of course he didn't. Uh, what is this? Um, how just some more family members fighting over Bohemia, as they often do. Title loss in succession. Not gonna happen. Dump another hundred on re-election. Usurped uh, temple. Sure, some rabbis usurping some synagogues in my country. They can do that. Trade post. Or merchant port built, rather, in a trade post. Created a duchy of uh, Bavaria. Sure. Peaced out with Poland. Okay. Any of these righteous imprisonments... Uh, I have a righteous imprisonment on my wife. Because I know she's trying to kill someone in my family, apparently. Okay. Any of these people uh, particularly rebellious? Hmm. Heir to the Bohemian Revolt. Okay, never mind. Don't care about that. The King of Bohemia, eh? Tempting. Faction leader, independence, and he's a member of Increased Council Power in Carpathia. And we have a low chance of arresting him. Okay. Where is he? His capital's right there. Okay. Park on it with your best troops. Yeah, just do that. And then we'll rest him, hopefully fail, he'll rise up, we'll knock him down right away, and then we can just revoke his lands if we need to. So let's uh, imprison him. We have evidence, so no one will object. Yep, he rose up. And he can't possibly win that. And until we fight them at least, we'll give a siege leader. Mustering grounds done. Beautiful. Get that troop count up. That's a high priority right now. We also do need to increase um, income, though, obviously. And retinue whenever we can, but we are above our limit right now, so we need to get that limit up. Are you in diplomatic range of China? We weren't before. Um, we are still not now? Yeah, we are still not now. I think, yeah, we are not within diplomatic range of China. Man, we're getting tech like crazy. This is great. Trade post has been built. Now we're within range, actually? I don't know if that would count. No, because we need to actually own the area. Apparently the trade post itself isn't good enough. Wow, look at how many more things are allowed here because it's on the Silk Road. Beautiful. And out of interest. Yeah, we could seize the city. Yeah, we actually have a war goal to seize the city. Because we have a uh, trade post there. Very tempting. They don't have many troops either. We'll deal with this war first, and then we'll go do that. I'd like to build up a little bit of money too. Just, you know, play it safe. Uh, you can get education and learning. Inherited a republic, that's fine. Uh, what is this? People wanting to, to marry off Mega Cakes. Uh, Poland and some other... No. Not happening. Don't care about alliances with either of those countries. Militia training ground, good. Get those troops. Whatever you can to get the troop number up. Can't afford to build more things right now. We gotta save up. Beautiful. 
All right, he's got such small troop numbers. Gains greedy. Yes, absolutely. I will strive to be more like him. Yes, I would love to be like my father and become greedy. That's money. All right, I'm just gonna wait for him to lock into that because that's a stupid place for him to go. <laughs> Why would he do that? Oh, another kid, another daughter is hoping for a son. Please end the pain. Do her best to treat the daughter. Yes, she's ill. Okay, you get locked in. Yes. Yes, Holy Roman Empire ended their stupid war. There we go. And an acquaintance I don't actually know died. Okay, please end the pain. Got proper treatment from the doctor. Good. What is this? Uh, Sam's knowledge. Oh, right. We're still trying to befriend the Holy Roman Emp Emperor. It's safe. Uh, tell us of our prosperous realm. Yes. I mean, he can't deny our income is probably better than his, right? Let's see. Yes, he's losing money. In fact, a lot. We are much richer nation than he is. All right, just start sieging what you're on. Daughter born. Uh, that daughter is not part of the bloodline, though. We need to have a lot of kids. Really want to expand this bloodline. Yeah. Matrilineal transfer, patrilineal in, uh, inheritance. That faction just keeps dipping down below the power threshold and above. They're still trying to do something here, but they don't have troops. Okay, we do need to deal with this right now. Don't let them raid it for more than I can help. Don't want to lose money. 100 military tech points, always nice. Raiders right there. I'll have to deal with that after I deal with this. Actually, no, deal with this now. Get them out while I'm in the area. Now my prisoner, can I ransom him? Nope. And then move the good ones back to this. Education for Jitka? Kinswoman. Education. Easy, and then we go back to sieging this stuff down. Offer to buy a new one. She gains fussy. Always happens. I've never seen that not happen. Receive news that the king of Bohemia has chosen to go into hiding to foil our plot against his life. Eh, sure, he can go into hiding. I don't care. Show up again? Okay. Just give them those guys for now. Uh, no, you're not marrying her. Mm -hmm. Hey, wife is pregnant again. Let's hope it's a boy this time. Really need a male heir. Victory. And more raiders over there. That's, I don't care about them. God, I need to end this war already so I can go declare war on the other place. Creating titles, that's fine. What is this? Uh, backer plot to kill our kinsmen? No. I don't want to be involved. Tech. Raiders, for fuck's sake. Ra oh, raiders in a neighboring country. It's not even my country, I don't care. Can the bloodline only fail, uh, follow through male members? No, it, it can go through female ones as well. However, only males can inherit in a merchant republic. At least that's my understanding of the inheritance rules on our bloodline, from what I read. Oh, 
Oh, hey guys, a court was built in the capital. 